first miracle to, uh, that I am alive is that the train couldn't continue to Auschwitz because after arrival within the first hour, my mother and my paternal grandmother, who was a widow at that time and with us, and my two little brothers immediately would have been put to, through the gas chamber and go up in smoke through the crematorium's chimney. I most likely would have been saved for slave labor. Would I have survived or not? Never could know. That was the first big miracle while I am alive. And the second one, when we arrived to Bergen-Belsen, that day they took away 1,695 people whom a Hungarian Jewish journalist lawyer, Rudolf Kostner, through certain channels, who was working for the Jewish uh, organization in Budapest, Hungarian Jewish organization, arranged that the Nazis for money and medicine allowed and agreed to exchange through gr two groups through Switzerland to be exchanged. And for this purpose, they put together 1,695 people in July 1944 in Budapest in regular train, not freight cars, and took them to the Bergen-Belsen concentration camp where they put them into a block, Sonderlager, they called it, special block, until the contingency of the exchange could be worked out. Those people who put up the money from the Western world we're asking only one thing, that these who are going to be exchanged to be family remnants together, male, female, old, and young. And the Nazis agreed to this. And this exchange took place. The contingencies worked out on December 4. They were taken away. And since the agreement was for two groups, the next train which brings in inmates into the Bergen-Belsen concentration camp, similar composition, old, young, male, and female, will fill that block. This second big miracle in my life that our train came in then, that meant we were put into the Zonderlager, we were not divided, male and female, old and young, we remained together, our clothing remained with us, our belongings remained with us, and that contributed to a large extent to the fact that I am alive. Aside of these two big miracles, there were dozens of smaller ones which contributed to the fact that I am talking to you here today.